Welcome to my trading room. This is how I do it. Hello traders, como se va? So, happy Monday. I started this week in green thanks to a trade that I don't know why I took. But uh, it worked. SKLZ. And then I took MQ. I took big share size. And then I just closed it before my original stop loss. My risk was too much. So I just closed it. And since then it's just moving sideways. So let's start with MQ. Okay, so I took MQ in my swing account. And today because of this beautiful daily, just amazing daily, I took it above 32 here. Okay. And then I waited, waited. I added above 32 again. And here I got it in a very bad price. And also here. So... I closed it after almost two hours in the trade, 87. Here, at the lows. Well, let's hope it's not the lows because after I closed it, it bounced back up. But too long, it moved sideways. It's still moving sideways. And you know, you can lose a lot of money if you stay in a stock that's moving sideways for so long, so long, because then it's going to choose direction, up or down. And if it was... If MQ will move down sharply, uh, I, I could easily lost 2K. Why is that? Because this is a fresh stock. This is this is an IPO. I still don't know how to read it day trading. But I took it for a swing, so let's hope it will work nicely today. And I took a BBBY. Just closed my last part with trailing, although it's still moving down. <clears throat> that was 15 cents trailing, and it's moved against me. 15 cents, 14. Okay got me so a uh, bbby i shorted it under 30 20 that was well should it for so long today okay that was here and i said in the room guys i'm not placing hard stop loss i'm going to build my position let me show you how okay okay you can say i took it under uh, 31 20 with 50 cents so I took half share size and then I added under 31 because who knows what's going to happen with BPBY. So I built my position and that's why I took it under this line 31.20 and I added under 31 and that was, I just took my first target 30.75 because everything is so slow and the market is not going anywhere. So I said, you know what, I want to lock some profits because Friday was a very bad trading day for me and I thought about it all over the weekend, which is the worst thing that can happen to a trader. But today, I started this day with SKLZ. And actually, I said in the room, hey, Merriam Scott, this is your trades, right? This is not my trade. Okay. Okay, so I shorted today SKLZ under 20.55. Why is that? Because I assume that if it's going to move under a, a 20.50, it's going to crash. And again, I want to get good entry price. So I took it under 20.55 under this line. Got me in, dropped immediately 50 cents, took my first target. That was amazing. And then I took another partial under 19.50. No, I waited. I said in the room, I'm going to be greedy. Let's wait. Okay, I survived the pullback. And I took it when it moved under 19.50. Yeah, that was here. I knew it, it is. Okay, so I took my second target here and I closed everything 1990. Above this line, 1985, something like this. So one good trade in a SKLZ made me 1800 and that's amazing because, you know, the daily chart is extended for the downside. But today when I saw this one minute chart, it felt like it's going to crash at least one point, which it did. So SKLZ, a nice trade that made my day. And let's talk about this trade, CRSR. Okay, now I'll place the link, you can see the square to my swing picks. And guys, you should follow because I don't know what's going on, but since I'm starting to make these swing picks videos, I'm taking good good trades. So I talked about OTLY, more than 20%. Coursera, C-O-U-R, more than 24%. And CRSR, 
I talked about CRSR here. I took out above 31.80 here. And I said in the room, and every time that I'm recording a video, I'm saying, yeah, I'm still in the trade. And people ask me, are you still in CRSR? Yeah, I'm still in the trade. Yes, I'm still in the trade. And here we saw two nice days. I said, okay, amazing, 35. Oh, that was earnings. I'm still in the trade with a small loss. And that's from Friday. And today I opened my platform and suddenly 30% up in a CRSR. So, of course, I sold. I took my first target in CRSR after 30%. I deserved it. So you should follow. And I'm finishing this day up 1700, which is nice to start a week like this. This is a lot of money. So, guys, thank you for watching. Don't forget to press the thumb up and subscribe my channel. I'll see you all tomorrow. Bye bye.